Hello, hello everyone, welcome back. Bogmod here. We are playing more Imperial Rome, where things are okay. I have two good friends, Thrace and Macedon. See? They love us. Aiding us in the war, we're allies. <coughs> Thrace loves us. We're allies. Um, the question kind of becomes, how am I going to expand soon? Barbarians up, up in the north. Diplomacy. Nope. That's it. So let's see. Oh. So these guys, all right. Oh, there we are. See, Rome's got fighting. With, it's fighting a war together with Rome. So it's probably going to put Rome into being a regional power, which I think might work in our favor. That said, I'd like to expand, and going north might be the thing to do. Actually, they're in alliance with Inguana. Uh, which is this guy. They're in alliance with Intimilta. Intimilia. Eight cohorts, nine cohorts, ten cohorts. We have twenty three. It might be worthwhile for us to try to attack. How would I attack them? Declare war, pick a goal to fight for. Superior naval superiority. Ah, I don't have a reason to go to war with them, though. Well, if it's the game I know... Ah, here we are, fabricating claims. Season so claimed provinces are cheaper to demand in peace deals. So we've got wood, salt, um, wood and salt. Oh yeah, they all have that. Four, five, four. No slaves. Oh, there's some slaves here. Hmm. Maybe we should, yeah, I think maybe we should be going north soon. Have the military tradition to form this technology. Do we lay down high quality wall and paint can greatly increase the efficiency of any offensive operation? Get reorganization. Force march, attachments. Oh, right, I can give them little commands, can't I? Do I build roads? Rome has roads. Oh no! Now to Arnes has died whilst attempting a murder at the age of 55. Well, that's not bad, is it? Um, I would think we shall put then. Velther, Atenia. He's got an eight. Hmm. 
Hmm. If they get two more cities, it will change the dynamic with them. Which is fine. Ah, the Arnie's family is grumpy again. Eh, that's okay. I'll let them be grumpy for now. For now. We can always try and fix that later. So... If I want to attack them, how much do I need again? Two hundred. Well, we're getting close. It's not bad. Here it is. Oh. A struggle between the religious echelons of our society and the peasants has recently come to light, as the populace at large feel... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Hmm. Uh, I feel like the religious ceremonies are inaccessible and distant. Uh, on the other hand, our high priest is like, No, 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 no. The people smell. We can't work with all those smelly guys around. So if I leave the priest alone, we lose stability. Ooh, I don't like that. Even if it makes Petru like me more. Or both sides gain some more. You lose 20 loyalty. But I'll rest down. <gasps> A free point of stability. I think that's the better option. Money, popularity, loyalty. The peasants are right. Open the gates of the temples. Yeah! To stability. Well, there we go! <clears throat> That's the kind of things I need to see. You know, I kind of want to have the humane co conduct. What's this? Circulated for some time now, but the vicious cruelty of Elbio Volturano. From kicking begging into the streets to laughing at public executions, he's truly really an nasty. Oh no! He's become cruel. Oh dear. <coughs> cruel! One less charisma. Uh, but the slaves work harder. Suffering and productivity come hand in hand. That is according to Elbio, at least. He's got two things to make him more likely to murder his way to the top. But you know what? I really want this diplomatic reputation, I think. The concept of battlefield honor has existed for millennia. Nonetheless, we should set down a code for dealing with our opponents that we ourselves might receive fair treatment in defeat. Alright, what's this? Sabinia wants military access from us. Why would they want military access from us? Ah, because they're in a big old war. To which I say... Yes? So yeah, if you look over here... Uh, they have a lot of causes bellies. Do they have on one on me? They do. Unpleasant, to say the least. <clears throat> However, Sabrina, Umbria, and P Picentia, they're at war with. They have an alliance with Apulia. They're in a defensive league, right? It's cause, because of their size. That will go away... Once they stop being a local power. Yeah, they can have join defensive leagues, where if you look at me... Cannot join defensive leagues. Called arms from Thrace. Thrace, who are you fighting? Istros, Miletos, Byzantion, Bithynia, and Heracles Pontica. 
Well, you know what? Of course, I will say yes. Although, really, Thrace, you should have picked a... You should have waited for this war to finish. With Mas uh, Macedon's war to finish. Which is against two again? First war of Thracian aggression. Oh no, it's... Oh, two wars. I guess Macedon won their war? Alright, well, I think it. I think it's... Mm, do I take the risk? Dare I take the risk? And march my armies... Well, you know what? Rome's at war. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna fabricate a claim. On... Um... I guess Pisa, Liguria, uh, Pisa, I suppose. Professor Pisa. All right. Oh, they added Oxbinia. I still think I'm. I, th I still think I could manage it. What do I have? 15, 24,000 troops? Yeah, I, f I feel confident with that. <clears throat> My turn to declare war to take Pisa. Macedon would join me, Thrace would not. Lacks border, another war. There we are. <clears throat> what? It said it said yes. We had an alliance. Hmm. Wait, why do they hate me for? I'm confused. But I, I, you know, we're gonna have to make progress with what we've got, I suppose. And honestly, I should have moved my troops perhaps into a better p position for that. Oh well. We'll uh, we'll work with this how we can. City of Portus Venerius, capital of the city of Venerius. Capital right there. He's got troops there. There we are, next stop. Always recruiting troops, but I don't think the troops can spawn if you're, the se place is being sieged. First Etruscan Genutin War is going in my favor. Oh, they would accept giving me that. I would gain a little bit of aggressive expansion. Alright, well, we're going to leave that as is for the moment.
Because maybe I can take even more territory. Raise city. I don't want to raise them. Full retreat. I know there's something about taking slaves. I can't remember the full details, though. Shock action. Just march. Alright, well, we'll take that for the moment, I guess. All right. Well, let's try and throw all my troops into their capital. I'm a little, little saddened with how things went with Macedon, honestly. Hmm. Ooh. Proof of their opinion. You know what? Let's improve their opinion. Because I would like to. I'd, I would like to turn this around. I don't know where where things got missed. And why they hate me for it, but we'll, we'll go with it. Oh, uh... Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks like somebody else is taking, taking advantage of the situation. I don't need my full group here. Too few men. Oh, never mind. Yes, I do need them. Oh, there we are. Yeah, you stay there. You stay there. There we are. I don't have any boats, though, so I can't exactly try to deal with that. Can I even build a boat? Oh. Shoring up defenses. As the denizens of the shining, shining city of Valvata have been feuding their neighbors in Birent, impressive fortified walls being erected in Valvata, quite outdoing the efforts of their rival. Gains 50 military points, or... You know what? I'll take 50 military points. Thank you, game. We'll cultivate friendship with the Macedonians. Ah, another daughter for our chief magistrate. She's not very good. Oh yeah, they gain stats over time. Kind of like children would. Oh no! I wasn't paying attention. But we are winning the fight. He has no heavy infantry. That'll be, that'll be that'll definitely contribute to it. Come on, my reinforcements, get there, get there. The Battle of Genoa. We are victorious. We lost seven, nearly seven thousand troops, slaying seven thousand of their own. There we are. Oh, no. Uh, Alright. How many, how many troops do I need to siege that, actually? There should be a way to tell this. Because mm, manpower... Let's take away. You. Hmm. A new invention. Is there anything that would help me with sieging? Ooh, prove opinion maximum 20%. I could get plus 60 
friending up Macedon with that, actually. You know what? I, I, want, I want to do that. A prelude to the later concept of permanent ambassadors, Proxenoi were chosen by Greek city-states to act as representatives in neighboring cities. Yes. Oh, we're still teching up slowly. Minus 14. Power slowly building. Still have plenty of manpower to spare. Oh, I've even got some money. Let's, let's get a building. Let's see what we get. Training camps. Gives us more manpower. Marketplaces. Increase our. Ooh. Well, you know what? I, I need civilization level, so I'm going to build a marketplace in our capital. So what happens if I pull you away? Can't siege. Alright, then you get to stay put. Alright, zero percent chance. It's slowly ticking over. percent good <laughs> he's reinforcing his forces boo on that hmm. but it looks like he's definitely caught up in another war in fact let's take a little peek at that Yes, he's definitely in a second war. Just what I like to see. Fourteen percent chance. And supply shortage. Slowly pushing up my uh, my chances. Ooh, seven percent chance they would surrender. It's been going on for ne uh, for a full year. Thirty-five. Oh, twenty-one percent chance of surrender. It's getting up there. Come on, keep doing it, guys. I believe in you. I believe in you. I want to see a victory for the Etruscans before the end of this uh, this recording session. 42, good. A water shortage. Oh, that's going to hurt them. Likely we're gonna lose. Mm, I don't want to lose. All right, let's. You know what? Let's just let's just take let's take what we can get rather than risk. Yoink! So you can head back there. Uh, the clan Ulf retinue can hang out here. Clan Trip Revenue can pull out here. And the First Legion can head back to our capital. Alright, well we got a little bit bigger. We got some more citizens. Yes. Yes. 
their unrest. Cost twenty points. Right over here seems. Oh, wait, wait, wait. 46. Ligurian. Ah, Ligurian culture. Well, that would explain it. So, we have exiled armies that we're fixing that. We're still at war with Militos and Istros. Armies are pulling back. Alright, well, you know what? We succeeded. We gained some cities. If I look at us. Is this the map I want? Yeah, we have 31 cities now. We gain just that little bit more territory. And we have some some governors. Yeah. I I think this is a good 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 success. We're gonna take a little break here. We'll figure out how to how to calm everyone down uh, next time. So thank you for watching everyone. And I will see you all soon for more.